guys welcome back to the elizardos yesterday was father's day and saturday was my 41st birthday woo -woo, i turned 41 and um i want to wish all of you guys a happy father's day for all the daddies out there and happy father's day to all the mommies that hold it down so today we are going to make something that i'm pretty sure that you guys have seen all over the internet because i've been seeing it everywhere it's that paper cap. I'm going to show you a little. This was my first cap that I made. Here in Texas, of course, our family is Dallas Cowboy fans. So this was the first one I did make. I ended up, you know, making these little things as well. The star and then the, the little sticker that goes on the bottom. I just did dad, my hero, the legend, my rock, the man. But I want to take this cap and I want to take it to like a whole nother level. I want to do a money cap. This is something that is going to be so awesome to give to your husband, your father, your kids, you know, anybody who's a sports fan, you can give it to them for a birthday, an anniversary. I just want to do something that I haven't seen lately. So I'm going to show you how to make this whole hat, right? Where to get it and everything. I ended up finding a youtuber and i have to find her name because she did awesome i'll probably link her down below she showed you where to get it how to you know print it out you know and stuff like that so i'm not going to take the credit for that i'm going to link her link down below her youtube down below so you guys can click on her and she'll show you just in case i miss a step or whatever but we are going to make a spurs again we live in texas in san antonio the Spurs are our team. So I am going to make a Spurs hat, but we're gonna make a Spurs money hat. Now let's get to it. First of all, I'm gonna use my Cricut. This little guy comes in handy, especially for that, for making this hat because it does the cutting for you. I don't have to cut it by hand. So if you guys have a Cricut, you know, it's gonna be a lot easier for you, but if you don't, don't worry, you can just cut it by hand and everything will come out the same. You're gonna need, we're gonna use our mat or glue, of course. We're gonna use the little zipper, the little zipper snack size bags, of course, for our money. Because you guys have seen so many videos that I have done with money and these are the perfect size for them. We're gonna use some little paper confetti to go inside of the box. This is the Spurs thing that I already made. You can just print it out on your printer from your computer. And then what I did was, that's exactly what I did was print it out on the computer. And then I cut it out and I put it on these stickers. Bought these stickers at Michael's. They were a little expensive. They were like $6.99, but I had a 20% coupon. So it kind of made it a little bit better. It does come with a lot of sheets anyways. You are gonna need cardstock. This as well as for Michaels, these were $4.99 and then I think I had a coupon as well. The good, well, I got the wrong size, right? Some people use the bigger one. So what I'm gonna do is just make the hat a little smaller just so it can fit in these papers and you will see what I'm talking about in a moment. Yeah. Um, so what you guys are gonna do is you're gonna open your computer and then you're gonna go to your, um, your browser. You're gonna type in your browser S VG. I will link the link down below for you guys. What we're gonna do, it's gonna look like this. SVG cuts. You're gonna make like your little, um, your accounts or whatever. And then you're gonna go to search and you're gonna do baseball hat. It's probably under something else, but still. And it's gonna look like this. It's gonna be this one right here. You're gonna click it. You're gonna download it to your computer. Okay, I already have it saved right here in my Cricut. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and click it and I'm gonna customize it. The size is going to be a 4.63 and a 6.225 on the side. You see that? They're all gonna be the same. These three will be the same. The 7.932. And you see right here, this is how you know how big your hat's gonna be. So if we get our paper, well, if we get our cutting mat and we get one of the card stocks, right? And we put it on here, you gotta even it out. You have to make sure that it's gonna be the right size. So mine goes a little bit over the eight. 
and this one does too. What I'm gonna have to do with these is I'm gonna have to split them all individually, but that's all right. It's gonna be a little bit more cutting for me, but I want them all to come out right. Since we don't have the bigger cardboard stock, we're gonna have to separate them all, which is gonna be easy. You're just gonna click on the, the one you wanna separate. You press the three little dots. You move object, put new, select the same color, confirm, and it just moves it. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move it this way and they're all gonna go right here. And I'm gonna have all this, all the shapes are gonna be um, facing the same way. So that one's fine, I'm just gonna continue. I'm gonna go ahead and press cancel. But it's all right, because it already made it, it's down here. And we're gonna do that to all of them. Sure there's an easier way to do this but i'm um, new to the cricket thingy i'm gonna make sure that this little part because this is the top of the hat is going to be in between the seven and the eight so i can know it prints right and then i'm going to go to the second one and i'm going to do the same to all of them just the ones not not the not not the hat itself just the little pieces those gotta go to another paper Now they're all by themselves. They're all gonna fit. We are gonna have 16, we're gonna have to do 16 cuts, but I'm okay with that because I do want a bigger hat. I just wanna make sure all the pieces are there because I think it's six of those and six of these with the little teeth. I'm gonna go from number one. We're gonna press continue. And we're gonna get our mats ready. Don't come from my mats, they're all messed up. I'm still learning. Okay, so everything already printed out. Oh, it was a hot mess. Oh, it just drove me a little bit bonkers. But anyways, you're gonna need six of these, right? Six of these, three of these, one of these, one of that, and your little um, top for your hat, right? So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna, you see where it's dotted? The Cricut did all that for me, which is good. I don't have to do none of that myself. So we're just gonna bend it and we're gonna do that to all of them.
So to make it a lot easier, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna follow the guide, right? So each one of these has to go right underneath there on top of it like that. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna start gluing these just to make the base. And we're gonna glue the top of this part. I don't wanna put too much. So this is where my Q-tip's gonna come in handy. And we're just gonna move it around. And we're gonna place this on top of it like that. Now we already made our little base. And then we're gonna do the same thing with the other one. Now this one, I'm gonna glue the bottom here and in the sides right here because this has to attach to this. Like that. So we're gonna glue, I'm gonna move this because I don't wanna stain that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it on the bottom. Then I'm gonna get it again. I'm gonna put that on the bottom. So that way it attaches right here from the inside and from the outside. So look at how clean that base is, especially because it needs to make that little curve right here. We can fix it and push it a little bit more down later, but I found it that it's gonna be a lot easier like that. So I'm gonna continue to do the rest of them. Gonna look like that see how we already made the base now we don't have to worry about this no more right i'm gonna go ahead and glue it i'm gonna glue put that to the side and i'm gonna start gluing these together just so we can start putting it together It's okay that it's messed up on the bottom. That's gonna be the bottom, they won't see that. Now we're gonna glue this. See right here, here's your guide again. It's gonna go like that. So we're gonna go ahead and glue that. We're gonna push this to the side. Now we're gonna start on the bigger hat. Well, the, the this part. Okay, so you only have one that looks like this, right? That's gonna be the back part of your hat. This is where we're gonna make the money part. So I'm gonna use this as a guide, right? Since the hole is right here and it's gonna go like this, I'm gonna cut the hole This is coming off like that. So we want it to be down here. Like in the middle, Like the back part. Yeah. I'm gonna do my cut underneath that hole right here. 
So um, since this is gonna be the guide, we're gonna go ahead and um, you gotta push all these down. Do that to all of your triangles, because that's where they glue together. I wanna make sure that they're all even. Well, all the same way actually, and they're not. So we gotta go the other way. Oops. Since we are doing the hole, we're gonna do a slit right here. It's gonna be right underneath the hole. Remember, it has to be on this part that has, this is the only one that looks like that. So I'm gonna get my scissors, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bend it, and I'm gonna cut, I'm gonna cut, how far was it? So I'm gonna cut right here. Made two little slits right here. I don't know if we can see them. Maybe on this side. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put my scissors, make sure that you got some thin scissors. And sharp. that now it looks like this and then I'm gonna turn it over like that and I'm gonna cut this part the little flap that's what's coming up and now we have a hole where your money can come out of and if it's not big enough I'm gonna put the hat together now that we already made the hole remember it has to go underneath your circle make sure you don't cut your circle off and we're gonna glue all these together oh this is gonna have work this is where i had problems a lot of problems and we have to go like this so what we're gonna do is i'm gonna put a little bit of glue right here Tip. And I'm gonna put it on here.
whatever. Okay. So now what we're gonna do, oh, one more. I'm gonna go ahead and glue this one to this one. When you're doing something and you see something you do it once and you're like oh i could probably you know because you're all frustrated from doing it and it doesn't come out the way you want it and then you think oh you know what you try different uh ways to put things together well that's what i thought about this hat Yeah, after almost having a damn heart attack. You just have patience. I don't have that. What is that? Yeah, look, this shit has glue everywhere. I mean, you would have, you would literally have to paint this hat so that way you wouldn't see all that glue. This glue's no good. Me and Michael's are gonna have a little problem, my dear, because this glue is a little chafa. Glue this on the top. And I'm gonna... Okay, whatever. Now we're gonna glue this part to the bottom of the the hat. This thing is supposed to go on top of it like that. And do, I'm gonna put it on there so it can guide me. It's crooked. It's crooked. It's crooked. Right there. I'm gonna go ahead and glue this part, the sticker on the front of it. Oh no, I don't have to glue it. It's a I sticker. sticker. It. Hello, see? And I'm just gonna, can you guys see it? Is it even right there? Right there. There? Mm -hmm. And then it's not Father's Day anymore, but you can use whatever you want. This is a sticker as well. I'm gonna put this on the bottom. We went over the top with the black marker. I don't know if you guys can see that, but we're gonna go ahead and just finish it off. I'm gonna get. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> they're all connected. 
I don't want too much. Oh my goodness, that's a lot. Put it all in there. If you're gonna put anything in there, you wanna make sure that you cut a cardboard just so that way you can harden it up, you know, from the bottom. Because if you put something in there, like heavy, like a bottle or something. You got it all gonna, on you. Right. Probably gonna fall apart. Okay, so whatever. What? Oh, yeah. <laughs> now what we're gonna do, I already put my money in the bag. You just, I just put it inside of it and then tape it and made it into like a, like this. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a little hole so the money can go down like that. And then I'm gonna bring it out. I'm gonna show you guys. So I'm gonna bring it out of here. And then there you have it. Just hold it down a little bit, you don't want it. Boom, 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 boom. See that? There you go. Ta-da! So, if you guys are going to make this hat, you better have a lot, a lot of patience because my patience are very thin and uh, it almost drove me to the break of, like, pulling my hair off. With that being said, we really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.